Another fun testing, motherfuckers. You know what he's coming for you. Why are you looking for to scream? <laughs> right now, we're gonna fuck you up. It's a hot pot. Hey, coming in. It's a hype. It's a so fucking hot. We don't know how to sing. Our brains are melting in this quarantine. Motherfucker. Right, so, <laughs> right, so we can talk about anything right now. We can talk about how I'm getting sensual with this microphone, the way I talk to it like this, and you're just staring at the screen. Doesn't make it any less Quinn Mackey's doing. We have to be right up on the mic. Um, I don't know yet. We're just starting. Um, the sound check. This is the best sound check. stepmother we were out in Vance on uh, my grandparents 
farm. And this light comes in, bro, like beside the window, just flashing. Woof, 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 woof. Changing colors. And my stepmom and I both saw this thing, and it's like it even hit the window a couple of times, you know, just. And then was gone. And we were both just like, that was something. <laughs> that was something for sure. There's no way that was just a bug or, you know what I mean? Um, but I've never, I've never had the pleasure of meeting an extraterrestrial being face to face, if that's what you're asking. Um, I've never been taken into a ship and probed. I don't want to, I don't want to possibly, like, if that has happened to you, I empathize entirely. Like, I'm not, not making light of abductions at all, but I personally don't have any first-hand experience. Um, what about you, Drew? What can you tell me? What, what are your dealings with aliens? They're really 4D. 4D. Four-dimensional. telling me that you were abducted once by the by the cast of Star Trek? Yeah? yeah? <laughs> no, please. Like, you say, like, mm, you don't know anything about aliens. Bring your alien knowing ass over here. You're like the foremost expert if you got to meet Deep Space Nine and Yeah, it was the changeling, man. You know the changeling, the security officer from Deep Space Nine? You know that guy? He's not, he's not really coming to mind right now. It's been a long time since I've seen Deep Space Nine, but like you got to meet the cast, not even the cast, <laughs> like met the actual, you met the changeling. Yeah, he looked at me like, like I, I like suddenly was paralyzed. I was just laying on my bed. Well, I was just totally paralyzed. I knew I couldn't move, you know. I didn't even try to move because I knew I couldn't. So it was like sleep paralysis, but... Yeah, and then he looks right at me and says, you know, something like, you know, this one woke up again. We have to send him back or some shit like that. And I was just kind of like, okay, well, I'm, I'm here. <laughs> 